I thought I was going to be a clinician, um, and I uh, ended up essentially fashioning a career at the university that was really based on building the capacity of faculty, staff, students, community members, and the institution and other institutions to do really quality community-engaged work. Well, my history with community engagement dates back to the early 1990s when I was brought into a what turned out to be a 10-year-long, really wonderful, deep, collaborative, community-based participatory research project with my community partner, Susan Gust, and many other people from the university and from the community and nonprofits and, and government. Um, and together, we designed two very large um, federally funded community-based participatory research projects on childhood lead poisoning. We were not just working on the lead poisoning issue, but we were working on the sort of leadership and economic um, and skill development within this community. It was very new to me to share power um, with community members in making scientific decisions, but I really saw the benefit of doing that. My career started as a practitioner of community-based participatory research. It turned into essentially someone who builds the capacity of others, including the institution, um, to do this sort of work. My community partner, Susan Gust, and I developed a community-based participatory research course as a result of and sort of utilizing as a case study the Phillips neighborhood work. I've always been concerned about how the environment affects children's development. So early in my career, it was about the toxic influence of the environment on children. Um, now I have sort of turned my career a little bit 180 degrees and I, I look at questions of how the natural environment can actually serve in a beneficial way to children's uh, development. I think I've learned the, the lessons of working collaboratively based on my early work in the Phillips neighborhood on work about toxic environments and translated that to my current work working in partnership with the Children in Nature Network on helping that organization build its capacity to provide the evidence for the benefits of the natural environment for children's development. So I'm really honored to be part of this part of the mission of the university and to, to use engagement to enhance the research and the teaching missions of the university.